man, this, this melanin is, is is received the same way around the world for the most part. And, okay. And there's different ways of countries expressing this racism and hatred. And I'm not saying, you know, of course, everybody's not like that. You can't look at one person who hates you in the country and think that you can stereotype the whole country that way. But racism exists all around the world. And unfortunately, people look at somebody with this melanin, this brown skin, and they and they want to lower that person to try to feel better about themselves because they don't want to be at the bottom. And unfortunately, that's how the world is. But it, it made my family strong. It made me strong. It made me a more fierce person and courageous person growing up. There's not a lot that I fear in this world. And I'm not saying fear is a problem. Sometimes fear is good. You can't be brave without fear. First, mm-hmm. you know, and but having those experiences growing up now, I can go out into the world and there's not a lot of things I'm afraid to to face. But I will say there's there's a lot of I don't know what the best word, but toneless countries when it comes to racism. They don't always realize our ignorance level, a certain level of ignorance because they don't always realize that the community requires certain things. But the world world has it's slowly changing. We still have a, a ways to go, but can't deny the progress. I hope the world continues to open up. I admire the younger generations that are coming up. I feel like they become more open-minded and, you know, hopefully it's a better place for our kids and our grandkids.